Subscribe to Ricardo Sandrio or I'm going to cry. Link in description. Hey guys, I'm Clam by the way here, and today I'll be showing you how to speedrun Death Forest. So yeah, let's just get into it. It's like 2 a.m. here. Just wanna play some Death Forest, and if you want a commentary on this, so I guess I can do that. Shit. Uh, I may or may not need to get one of those. Alright, so, first off, you want to go backwards in here, like this, surely I don't fuck up my runs, surely not, I'm actually being a fool, alright, well, we're going to talk about that segment right there, where I just messed up completely, but yeah, that's the start of the run right there, except not scoffed. Hopefully, if you're getting a world record, you're not fucking it up. Someone's just gonna take it away, or you can just. I think I have them up my ass now, I'm not gonna lie, because I was a bit too slow now. But basically, you wait there for a second until we get. And you have very strict timing with that part. And you just wanna wait until he goes into the part looking at you. Well, while you're there, you then grab a battery, quickly, and that should keep you supplied for a long time, and here you want to hug the wall, so you walk on them, like this, which is, hugging the walls in this game is very, very important, but you have to be good at it, or then you're done, basically, it can, like, lose you three or four seconds, depending on how much you do it, of course. Like, right here. I will hug there. Uh, I got me a bit of a time loss. But, you know, or like a millisecond time loss, but that still is very important when speedrunning. Right there, I just want to grab that battery quickly so I have a decent amount of batteries for a while. And we're just going to go straight into Uma. A little cage type shit area. Give him a quick smooch. Now in this section, you just wanna go right and left. Then <laughs> I probably should have honestly uh, pre-recorded this and then commentated over it, but no, nah, I'm just gonna do it live. Can't be fucked doing it at two a.m. But all right, so. Here we go, uh, go into the tunnel with Uma, and here is when things get a bit harder. Like, the stuff we saw earlier was some easy, but it's when it gets a bit harder. At least in my opinion. Why do we have the main man himself going after me? Don't tell me I got him. I hate seeing him like this. This part, it always makes him look so much creepier. Like seeing him when we're not seeing him at all. Of course he's better involved. Fuck, I did too late. Okay, well, I don't think that's too much for time loss. And honestly, if anyone at speedrun.com is watching this, please make a category for Death Forest. Because there is an actual scene for it from what I can tell. At least so far. I've been trying my ass off trying to help out with the scene. Give it a bit of recognition. Alright. And this is where the scam happens. That's the scam right there. And you hope to god this little man isn't after your ass. But if he is, it doesn't matter too much, honestly. He can easily be juked, like you just saw there. Unless, you know. And basically having these two men follow me right now, it's kind of, it kind of works my favor, I'm gonna be honest. Kind of does. Well, I just want to give my time right now to give some other people 
some credit where it's due, of course. Uh, Ricardo Sombrio. That guy is an absolute legend. Subscribe to him, please. Like, I beg you, please. Subscribe to that guy. He's he's literally so nice. Um, his content is great. Just please subscribe to him and help him out. Honestly. Holy shit, why did I get jump scared? I'm not supposed to get jump scared. Who do I think I am? Oh, here. I think I just wall hug. I don't even know if there's like world record times going on. I think this is a pretty shit run so far, but it's alright with me. I'm mainly going for explanation. And here, you want to hang out near the iron things for a secret little trick that I nearly didn't do correctly there. And there we go. Now here, what you do is you just drive a motorbike, just drive it correctly, and drive straight here, completely straight. I think that gives you the fastest speed, I don't know. And here we go, into this. Cutscene. And that's where the speed run ends right there. Here we have the main man coming up, the cast, the warrior where music playing in the background. It's not actually, but sounds like it. We have our main man, the stalker. He's not the main man, he's like the most virgin man. This is the main man, the stranger. He's the main man. I fucking love him. That's my boy. That's like the perfect representation of me. Yoshida, no one cares about her. She can go sleep in a cabin. Don't question what that means. Uma. Uma's pretty cool. And there's the main man, Yoshi. Or as I call him, Suichi. And you, you know what I mean if you know what I mean. And my boy. Well, not my boy, but I wish I knew this guy, Kaz. Kaz did all of this by himself. Shout Honestly, how the fuck? Musmus.man.jp Programming, Kaz, other work, UD. Thank you for playing, thank you, sir. And. Are we good? In the credit? Uh, we gotta let him roll a bit. More, you know. Give him a quick one. I think it ends around a second away now. What does the bottom right say? If someone can read Japanese characters, please tell me. And I've never really looked at it. I don't know, it's late at night right now, but I just look at this for a minute. This is the shed where the child comes out of. Trying to search for secrets. <laughs> Jesus, I'm on a version. But, uh, of course, subscribe to Ricardo Sombrio, subscribe to Bro Lake, an absolute legend as well. Uh, he's been on my channel for a bit now. Fucking love that guy. And also, subscribe to uh, me, no, just kidding. Alright, uh, if you watch this far, thank you so much, and I'm out.